The Riot Future Sea Rider likely refers to the Sea Rider, a revolutionary e water mobility product. It's a hybrid between a motorcycle and water sports, merging history with innovation. The Sea Rider was born from passionate engineering experience and rider enthusiasm. One of their products, the Sea Racer, is built for adrenaline boosting speed and fun. It puts 45 horsepower, 33 kilowatts, worth of dual e-motor power behind its 143 pounds weight, offering a claimed top speed of 47.8 miles per hour, 77 kilometers per hour. The Sea Racer offers 50 minutes of autonomy and a maximum speed of 77 kilometers per hour. With its high performance capabilities, this model maintains a total weight of 65 kilograms, ensuring precise handling and the highest levels of performance on the water. Gibbs Bisky The term Bisky refers to an amphibious motorcycle created by Gibbs Amphibians. It is unique in that it can transition from land to water and vice versa at the push of a button. The Bisky features a 55 horsepower engine that allows it to travel at speeds of up to 80 miles per hour on land and 37 miles per hour on water. It also has a transition time of less than 5 seconds, so riders can enjoy a seamless experience as they go from cruising the highway to riding across the waves. At just 2.3 m long and under 1 m wide, it is the smallest of all Gibbs high-speed amphibious platforms and very probably the most technically advanced. The Bisky can reach speeds of up to 80 miles per hour on land and 37 miles per hour on water. The transition from road mode to water mode is done in less than 5 seconds, so riders barely lose momentum as they ride in or out of the water. It's powered by a two-cylinder petrol engine that outputs 55 horsepower. The Bisky represents true freedom for the individual and offers serious fun. The Sherp is an incredibly capable off-road and amphibious vehicle designed to tackle the most extreme conditions. Originally designed to work in Siberia, these machines are known for their simplicity, durability, and capability. Can traverse water obstacles like ponds, lakes, rivers, and even frozen surfaces. All weather operates reliably in extreme temperatures ranging from minus 40 degrees Celsius to plus 45 degrees Celsius. High capacity can seat up to 9 people and carry a maximum payload of 1,200 kilograms. With an optional trailer, the payload capacity can be increased to 2,100 kilograms. Low ground pressure Sherp exerts minimal impact on the ground it travels on, making it environmentally friendly. Eco-friendly engine The 55 horsepower diesel engine complies with strict emission standards. The UHAC, which stands for Ultra Heavy Lift Amphibious Connector, is a massive amphibious vehicle designed for the United States Marines. Developed by Navitec, it is a prototype vehicle meant to replace or supplement the current landing craft air cushion, LCAC, hovercraft and landing craft utility, LCU. The UHAC is a track vehicle that can travel on both water and land. It's much faster on water than the currently used AAV, amphibious assault vehicle, and can even transport them to get closer to shore. The UHAC is also reported to be able to carry up to three M1 Abrams tanks, making it a highly valuable asset for military operations. Amphibious can travel on both land and water. High capacity can carry three M1 Abrams tanks or other heavy equipment. Faster on water than the AAV, this allows for quicker transportation of troops and equipment closer to shore. Low ground pressure, this minimizes damage to the ground when traveling on land. The Scupster definitely sounds like it'd be perfect for underwater aerobatics. The Scupster is known for its exceptional maneuverability thanks to its twin independently controlled propellers. The Scupster Wet Submarine Craft is a revolutionary project that began in 2009, merging the realms of underwater exploration and technological innovation. 
The Scubster team showcased their unique underwater vehicle at the 11th International Submarine Race in Bethesda Naval Surface Warfare, USA, in 2011, securing the Innovation Award. This craft is distinguished by its exceptional maneuverability, facilitated by two independently rotating propellers controlled via two levers. This design allows the Scubster to perform all movements with only two drives, setting it apart as the only submarine with such capability. The Quadrifoil is a fully electric-powered and environmentally friendly hydrofoiling watercraft. It offers a unique and thrilling way to experience the water. Electric motor powered by a reliable electric motor, the Quadrifoil produces zero emissions, making it a clean and sustainable choice for boating. Hydrofoiling technology hydrofoils are wing-like structures that lift the hull of the boat out of the water at high speeds. This reduces drag and allows the Quadrifoil to achieve greater efficiency and higher speeds than traditional boats. Easy to operate the Quadrifoil is designed to be easy to operate, even for beginners. With a simple joystick control, you can quickly get up and foiling on the water. The Quadrifoil is a safe and comfortable way to enjoy the water. It features a stable design and comfortable seating for two passengers. Long range with a range of up to 100 kilometers, 62 miles, on a single charge, the Quadrifoil can take you on extended adventures on the water. The Jet Capsule GTF, also known as the Gran Turismo Foil, is a futuristic-looking watercraft designed by Pierpaolo of Lazzarini Design Studio. It's described as a flying spaceship on water due to its unique design and features. The GTF is highly customizable, allowing clients to configure the interior for various purposes, from leisure use with 10 passengers to commercial use with up to 20 passengers. It utilizes hydrofoil technology, which lifts the hull out of the water at high speeds, reducing drag and enabling faster cruising speeds and improved fuel efficiency. The watercraft features a cutting-edge hydro propulsion system with twin hydrostatic transmissions. Power options include 880 horsepower to 1,200 horsepower diesel, petrol, or a full electric configuration. The capsule-shaped shell is made from a combination of carbon fiber and fiberglass and is equipped with photochromic windows made of 70% carbon using vacuum infusion molding. These windows automatically tint to adjust to sunlight intensity. The Iguana Commuter is a high-tech amphibious yacht tender built by Iguana Yachts. It's known for its versatility and luxurious features, making it ideal for island hopping, exploring secluded coves, or simply adding a touch of excitement to your yachting experience. The most striking feature is its ability to seamlessly transition between water and land. Retractable tracks allow the commuter to drive on beaches or uneven terrain, providing greater access to remote areas. On water, the sleek hull design contributes to a smooth ride and a top speed of up to 42 knots, almost 50 miles per hour. Luxury design the commuter boasts a stylish and comfortable design. The convertible hardtop transforms from a sunshade to a fully enclosed weatherproof helm, offering flexibility based on weather conditions. The cozy cabin with a built-in bathroom provides a space to relax and freshen up during your adventures. Customization the commuter can be customized to meet your specific needs and preferences. Engine options range from a single powerful engine to twin configurations for even more speed. Aviara has released two new boat models for 2024, the AV32 and the AV28. Both are designed to be luxurious day boats that provide an unforgettable boating experience. The AV32 is a 32.6 foot long vessel with an inviting open layout that is perfect for entertaining. The spacious deck is thoughtfully accessorized for maximum comfort, ensuring you and your guests can relax and unwind in style. At the helm, you'll experience total control with the unique triple display dash, joystick piloting, and handcrafted Italian steering wheel. 
You can choose between powerful Ilmer or Mercury engines for a quiet and smooth ride. The AV-28 is a 28-foot day boat available in three variants, outboard, stern drive, and a wake surfing edition. 